Jim Parquet here with Velo Pro Baseball. I'm going to demonstrate for you how to get your arm good and loose. As a big league pitcher, very, it was always important for me to get my arm loose, and one of the things that I always utilized was band. I just sit here and start to work this, get going with it. I could go really big, right? I could go standing tall. A lot of times I get into a stride position, hand behind, chest out, and get on that. But you want to work all angles, so sometimes in this you can incorporate some pulls, right? Um, you can sit here and get onto the side, but kind of your, your imagination is the limit. But I would highly recommend that you at least start in this position with your feet wide, get a little bent over with your hand back because what that does is that engages more of your upper body. If I'm here, that's not as effective as if I'm here because it gets me into a better spinal position. And then I just start working this. You should feel full on your teres minor and your upper lat shouldn't feel as much pull here unless you get sideways and start doing it. Then you'll start to get a good stretch that way. But once you start getting up, it's more of the front of the shoulder and a little of the back. Um, but basically, that's how you kind of get your arm good and loose and get those motor patterns started.